Greetings and welcome back to Railroad Corporation. I'm Catherine of Sky, and in the last episode, we got some stuff moving and we bought a farm. Now, I'm hoping that this will bring us some big bucks. It looks like we're already getting some benefit from that. Hopefully, we're selling the meat to the uh, the city by itself here. And uh, yeah, we're, we're making stuff. And oh, oh, here we are. Look at this. Um, and I'm wondering if when we get these items that maybe we don't have to pay the fees and all that kind of other stuff. Um, and then we can just get stuff essentially for free instead of having to buy our, or sell the grain at a low price and then have to rebuy these other things. So I'm pretty confident that life is going fairly well here. Oh, oh, we need to have three, three employees at the same time. That I didn't notice. Uh, okay, what we want to do though is start connecting Nashville because there is a textile mill there. Um, or we could connect Atlanta, but I feel like that's really far away for these freight deliveries. So I'm thinking let's upgrade Chattanooga for a number of reasons. Let's upgrade this. And we need to put in some new facilities here. First of all, we're going to need a repair shop so that we can repair our trains. <clears throat> and I also think we should get a coal warehouse fuel station will be 10% cheaper. Okay, um, what else can we do here? We have one more room left. Yeah, space available one, space occupied five. We can have fuel filling will be faster or cheaper maintenance. I think cheaper maintenance is probably the best thing that we can do. What that does, it says price per service is reduced by a hundred. So when we look at these uh, trains, we can actually schedule service and um, price for service is $300 at least. So that's a huge, huge benefit to us. What I am confused about, it says it's 10% uh, cheaper, but $100 off of the minimum $300 is 33% cheaper. So it doesn't quite jive, but <clears throat> what we can also do is upgrade these various things. Um, and let's see, we need rooms to extend them if we want to make it better, 15% and 25% cheaper. This is a hub, so I think it's probably worth it. So let's get another upgrade, upgrade the coal warehouse. There we go. And can we get this one? Okay. So 25% cheaper. I hope it's going to work pretty darn well. Now we can also look at this station. We see there's another entrance here so there's two entrances per side i think let's see i want to get these trains off the track right now let's go ahead and unpause for a minute oh looks like they are in okay looks like they're in okay and what i want to do is just reconnect the tracks uh, a little bit here can i let's remove this and i'd really like to do like can i just Okay, that's what we'll do. We'll do it this way and then connect this one into, uh, okay, why can't we confirm? Occupied by train. <clears throat> that's not ideal. <laughs> that's really not ideal. No. Can I undo? I can't undo the rest? No? Control Z? No. Okay, so yeah, that was not good. Confirm this. We'll do this thing like that. And hopefully we'll get whatever train is occupying this. Oh, wait, here we go. Confirm. Okay, so with this one, we'll remove this bit here. There we go. Okay, nice. And we did get a little bit of money back from this. Now then, I want to get some employees maybe to rails. Okay, minus five. Let's hire that person for now. Uh, and then we'll go to Nashville and get some stuff done. Now, what I want to do also is we need to create a connection from Chattanooga to Nashville and then Nashville to Knoxville to kind of cut out some of this journey going across here. So let's just get that going. We need to, oh no, this is too, oh, we can do a 20 mile an hour thing here. Okay, that's fine. And then connect this one that way. Oh, that's going to be great. Okay, good, good. Looking good. Confirm no tunnels or bridges. Okay, good. Do I get any more employees? No employees for hire. No. Okay. Well, it's fine. <clears throat> We're just gonna, just gonna pay it then. It'll be okay. So let's get this double tracked. 
feel that's a good idea. Oopsies, can't make this any tighter, which is okay as well. We'll just go this way. Now then, before I want to connect this whole thing up here... Oh, no, we have to do it this way. Let me just cancel this whole thing. Let's escape that. And I want to upgrade this one to a two-track thing. Make sure that we have... No, it didn't give it... I think we need the bigger station. I think we need probably this one. Okay, we're getting very, very shy on the money here. Okay, now, do we want it this way? No, I think we don't. I think we want this one to go here. Let's just put it this far ahead there. Confirm. Okay, we'll delete this track going into here. Aha! And now we can get this one kinda... This is gonna look really silly, but I think it's for the best. Okay. No, come on, thing. I'm clicking it, but sometimes it doesn't want to click well. Okay, keep on going. All right, and then we can click it there, confirm. Okay, looking pretty good. Now, unfortunately, we can't afford to run a train just yet, but we will get there. We will get there. Okay. Hoping, looking, looks like we are selling some meat to City Hall, which is nice. Now, one thing about the train system in this game is that trains will wait for money, uh, for the items. So if there are, if we have a train picking up meat at Chattanooga and going to Knoxville, and there's only one car here and we want to pick up three cars it will not go with partial loads it's basically wait until full all the trains so be very careful when you're designing things because of that uh, i will go ahead and pick up buy a locomotive i don't think we have one taking meat yet nope okay Ooh, broken train okay did we get our research done yet? I've kind of forgotten. Yep, we're done with the research. So I want to move to the next research. Can we afford it though? Yeah, let's get this. All locomotives fuel consumption is down 5%. So we'll take that one and put all 10 scientists that we have on this. Okay, good, good. And we'll let that happen. Kind of missed that notification in the right hand corner why this one is waiting so this is one thing oh this is is that the one that's broken t2 you are there nope so this one t3 is waiting so far behind um i'm not a fan of this i really wish we could put signals on the tracks um because of this this issue of like they're not getting to where they're needing to go uh let's go ahead and build a train and clog the lines even more um let's see this one is 172 a month, has 43 horsepower. I'm gonna go ahead and buy the fr best friend because we already know what we wanna do here. So let's go ahead and just do Knoxville first since that's the first train, that's where it's gonna start from. Then we'll go into Chattanooga and Chattanooga is gonna load up the meat. So I wanna take two meat. Yeah, two meat because otherwise it's very, very low. Uh, miles per hour and then we'll unload the meat here what do we have in knoxville probably nothing maybe we'll take one passenger uh, and then unload one passenger then we'll apply this just so it doesn't run totally empty that way uh, i'm also going to buy another train to go from chattanooga to nashville um well, actually, we don't even need it for the meat anymore because we have Knoxville. You know what? I'm going to take this train and change the route. Instead of going to Knoxville, I'm going to have it go to Nashville. Okay, so we're going to unload the meat here. Yay. And then load on some passengers. Let's do three passengers here. Yep. Three is good. And unload the three. Okay. Okay looking good <clears throat> oops it's in pause okay good good okay so that means we should okay so train four is going it's on the other track here 
Still waiting for this when it's broken down. Oh my god, what a backup on stuff here. It's train two, can we repair this guy? It's at 24%, so let's go ahead and do the repair thing and apply. Make sure you apply the changes here. Uh, let's check out the other trains. This is at 49%. I guess we'll just apply to every one of them. Now you can put the trains on a um, cycle thing like this, but <laughs> the problem is you pay two, $300 or less, I guess, since we have the, the discount, but they repair every single time they go to the station. They don't wait to like 75% or 50%. Uh, so I'm not a fan of that at all. Okay, let's take this one. That one's not ready to be repaired. So for a while, you have to micromanage that. Maybe if I was making tons of profit, maybe that would be better. Um, but anyway, we'll hopefully we'll get it sorted out. But I really wish, I wonder what this upkeep thing is. Is that the how much we're generating per month? Or is it just that we own the production and making profit from not having to buy and sell? I really don't know. Why is this train waiting? Is it waiting for train one? So this is, I really wish we had the whole signal thing going on here. Why is this one waiting? T4. Next station, Chattanooga. Let's see if this one goes to the station, is it then gonna move? Nope. It's just sitting there. <laughs> no, it's not moving. I promise you it's not moving. No. Why? Why game? Why? Uh, anyway, there are some bugs, obviously. Uh, anyway, we do have some money here. So I think what we should do is... All right, we are getting passengers going from... We're not getting passengers. We're getting from here going to the other one. But we do need to... Do we have mail in any of these towns? No, just in Nashville for now. But we can start to build the other rail line to the other side, which is kind of important. So we'll build this past this junction here. Let's see, can we do this? Thank you. And then go here. And then make another crossover. Okay, 14,000, sure. Can I buy another employee? I just want cheap employees. Uh, relocation, let's see. Employee office space requirement is low. Let's hire, oh gosh, they're expensive people. I don't want expensive people. There's T6, train six. Let's take this one, confirm. Okay, and then let us make this a double tracked line. Cause that's important. Okay, there we go. And there, confirm. Segments for. Someone was saying that with every segment you get signals, but I haven't seen that. Uh, we just have signals where they're kind of joining up. There's some weird little signaling things here, like this one has two there, but uh, we definitely don't have four segments. Wait, is there one there? Actually, there is one here. So maybe, maybe you do have to just split the whole thing up into segments. I don't know. Uh, that's a little bit annoying, uh, just slightly annoying. Uh, so anyway, we have this going on. Um, so maybe, maybe we should do that. I don't know. But trains do seem to go along uh, most of the time. Okay, so this is an interesting situation here where we have one train being repaired. We probably need multiple repair bays. Uh, we could do uh, cheaper maintenance. Let's see if we can install this. It's 5,000. Yeah, go ahead. Um, and then upgrade this to, we need two rooms for this though. Let's see uh, if we, okay, so price per service reduced by $200. Wow. Let's, um, do we want to get one? Un... Okay. Two locomotives can be maintained. Let's go ahead and upgrade that. This is going to get very expensive, but it'll be fine. So here we got two going because otherwise we can't, uh, it's going to take us a long time to repair stuff. And I know that these trains need repair pretty darn uh, often. This is another nice thing that we can get. Two trains can be filled at the same time for fueling. Okay, this is going to be good. Train six delivering some stuff. Yay, money. Good, good. 
Okay, here we go. Train two is going... Do we have any other issues? Train four seems to be broken down. Or is it repairing itself? Oh no, it is getting maintenance. Okay, great. That's a good thing. So let's look at our list, make sure that we're not... Oh wow, we have 68 days to make this happen. Okay, we really need to save money to buy that textile factory. We've been kind of doing everything else, which is not ideal at the moment. I think it was like 46,000. So we can go to minus 50,000, but I'd rather buy it for cash. But man, this exp uh, the maintenance takes a long time. Okay, it's all good though. It will be fine. It will be fine. Mail is also one of the commodities that is per 100 miles. It's $500 per 100 miles. So if we find another place that has mail, probably Atlanta here, or there's a city here, Birmingham. No, it doesn't quite have it yet. Okay. Uh, that's all right, though. We're going to hopefully make money. Come on, folks. Hurry, trains. Repair, repair. Maintenance, maintenance. Go, go. Let's see. Train 6 is coming in here. 56 days left on that. Hopefully we're going to get some decent money though from this. But having a double track system really helps with the uh, uh, the traffic por portion of the game. All right, nice. We're getting some money. That's probably the passengers coming in. Okay, then they're fueling. There we have two trains fueling with coal. That's interesting that this one stopped. Do we have the two fueling stations? No. Okay, we don't have two. Why, what is train six doing? Cargo is loading, okay. It's getting the meat. And it does. Did, I don't think we had to buy the meat. So that's really nice. So Nashville, we're gonna sell this for 7,000 each. We have 47 days uh, to buy the textile mill. Let's get that going. I'd rather not have all these employees, but I'm just going to hire some cheap ones. Let's see. Soil works. Sure, that's cheap. Employee salary plus 40%. Wow. Gee, that's a lot of money. All right. In any case, hopefully our trains are going to get going here. Do we need to repair any others? Let's see, this one's at 81%, 71%. It's kind of weird because it's like they just got repaired. Oh, do you not have Cookville to Knoxville? So Knoxville doesn't have a repair station? Ooh, we need to probably add that, but after we buy that uh, textile mill, I think. This is at 72%. At some point, it feels like they get really... They start to age very quickly, or they don't get filled very quickly. But, yeah. Let's check on our science. I have no idea if it completed or not. Ooh, it did. Okay, so 5,000, sure. Let's do 10 scientists on this. Get the new locomotive up and running. All right, we can probably buy this textile mill now uh, to fulfill that objective. We have 30 days to do that, but I think as soon as we get that, we're probably going to have another um, goal to fulfill. So I want to get as much money as possible. Uh, in case it's like, hey, deliver textiles and stuff and cotton. So want to get that uh, definitely moved on. Now, one thing that I'm not sure about is I think trains can go through stations, but we're going to have to test that and see if we can get to Fort Payne and this cotton field over here. All right. Train six is coming back. We're going to get some more money, I hope. Money is good. Money is good when you're running a railroad simulation, that's for sure. Okay, 21 days left. So we definitely don't want to fail this objective. Uh, so I'll probably buy it very shortly. Maybe when train six comes in or something. Whoa, 72,000. Okay, I think that should be fine. Let's build, let's buy this textile factory. Now, 46,000. Here we go. Okay, boom. Boop. We got it. Now then, we need clothes delivered. Okay, now this is a difficult one. So we have to, del oh no, <laughs> oh no, 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 no. We have to deliver them to Atlanta. That's all the way over here. So it looks like we're gonna have to, we're gonna make the textiles here. We're gonna take them to Knoxville where we have the leather and those are gonna be used to produce the clothes. 
And I think we might want to buy this clothes factory because buying $20,000 per each clothing is going to be very, very expensive. Um, okay, so the first thing we want to do here, let me, I think we're going to just go through the station. I think it should be fine. I don't know. We're going to try it. It'll be okay, I hope. So let's just choose this way of going here for now. Oopsies, come on. There you go. Confirm. Uh, it's going to cost us 20,000. That That's the bridge thing, I think. Uh, all right, I guess that'll be okay. I mean, we don't have much choice otherwise. Let's just wait for a little bit of money. I'm kind of wishing for like a one, two, three to, tr to control the speed of the game. That would be really nice. How much is the new locomotive? Uh, oh, we have the John Bull. We didn't get the, the, uh, the DeWitt Clinton yet. Okay, we're close. We're close. We have 31 days for that. So that's going to be at uh, the end of October. I could just buy the other one. I could just do that. But we do have a lot of days. We have to got three years, almost three years, well, like two and a half probably years to get that one done. Now, the things you see here, the sort of graduation cap with uh, points here, this is experience points. And that is kind of the meta game that you can experience after each, after each scenario, you can choose certain things to level up in that meta game. Let's see if I can, okay, skill points 950. I don't know if we can access this. There's the office. Let's see, Harrington's Railroad. List of buildings owned. Ooh, do we get to, no, of course not. Reports, ah, here we are. Can we click on these things? Ooh. All right, so here we go. Fourth quarter, oh, current quarter. Okay, assets, liabilities, income, sales, 29,000 building, depreciation, train fuel, train upkeep. And then we have net profit and loss, uh, obviously. It doesn't show us though what we're getting for the buildings, but I'm guessing it's just the whole, you know, you buy, you buy the, what do you call it? You buy the farm. Well, you have the farm actually. You could, oh wait, we could buy the farm, couldn't we? Uh, anyway, the whole thing is you, you buy the wheat. That's what I meant to say. You buy, buy the wheat for 800. You bring it here. You pay maintenance on the building, but that magically turns into both of these. So you get these for free and then you can sell them at the other end. I think that's kind of the way it works here. Uh, all right. So let's see. We, I really want to get that better. Tra Actually, it doesn't really matter to get the better train. Yeah, let's just buy a locomotive. Oh, yeah, it does, because it is, I thought, oh, that's just a short hop, but it's not. It goes all the way to Nashville. So we want to make sure that we get that going. At the end of October, we'll have the DeWitt Clinton, so we'll be able to upgrade that. Now, soon we're going to have a major problem here in Knoxville because we're going to fill up this leather slot. And once it's full, <laughs> it won't accept it anymore. So not ideal not ideal i'm watching the bottom corner of the screen here to make sure when we get the dewitt clinton okay there we go locomotive completed we just go to slow speed here and then pause again so i think i might want to upgrade all of my trains so this is 120 a month it's a very good deal 41 horsepower this one has 53 max speed 55 um let's see greater max mileage, fuel consumption 6.7. It's it's all around better. Uh, it's really, really much better. So I would like to kind of replace all the trains at some point. So let's buy the DeWitt Clinton for this particular route. So let's get Fort Payne with cotton, loading cotton. Uh, how many do we need? A few? Wow, 35 miles an hour sounds great. At a station, Nashville. Oh yes. Okay, and unload the cotton. Now Nashville, we can also load passengers, I think. 
Oh yes, let's get some passengers. Okay, that's overloaded, but here we can still go 35 miles an hour. And then we're gonna add a station of Chattanooga, cause why not? I mean, it's on the way. So we're gonna unload those passengers here. Good, unapply. All right, so uh, that, that one will come all the way from over there. Let's look at our research again. Um, what I have done in the previous game that I played on stream is like start a couple of these items. So uh, let's do fuel consumption. That's gonna save us some money. Uh, and then I also wanna do maybe reliability. Yeah, uh, or power acceleration time. So what I'll do is I want the fuel consumption first. So I'll put nine people on this. And then when that's done, it'll actually, it'll just start doing this one, you know, to get something done instead of nothing done. Okay, so then we wanna get a train at Nashville to take the textiles over to Knoxville. Okay, oh, I can hire some people, let's see. Soil works, sure. Uh, ooh, rails and soil works, let's hire you. That should be three, great. Do we need any of these people? I feel like I don't necessarily need them. Construction cost is lower. Oh, these are real railroad barons, how nice. Uh, I'm going to, I don't know if it's really worth $430 a month. Um, I don't really build that many. Ah, I'll keep them. Why not? It'll be fine. It'll be fine. Okay. Now, the other thing I want to do is buy, uh, this, the place in Knoxville. I want to buy this factory, the closed factory. It's 69,000. Uh, and I also want to start replacing these locomotives here. Uh, I do want to buy one more locomotive to go from Nashville to Knoxville. By the DeWitt Clinton, add a station, Nashville to Knoxville. There we go. Loading the textiles. Hey. Oh, we can only do two at a time. No. Okay. Looks like we might have to get that organized. One, two, oopsies. Anything we can load here? Not really. Uh, we do need to deliver that stuff to Atlanta. And the problem with this, it's very, very annoying. Okay, go ahead and do this. And I'm actually gonna copy this train and buy a second one. Um, yeah, maybe we'll buy a second one. Okay. Now the issue is when you have this kind of thing where you have the money thing, usually, it doesn't pay you for anything. It's a contract. So you're gonna get research points. You are gonna have to deliver this for free, which is really expensive. I'm not a big fan of this at all. So you kind of have to float that cost. I guess you could have like maybe one clothing going back and forth. Maybe I should train, train the trains to do that. I don't know. Like this one. Yeah, I guess we could load clothing. No, I don't want to do this because then if the other train is going from Knoxville to Atlanta, then it's going to get messed up a little bit. Yeah, I think that's that's a better thing to not do that. Okay, in any case, it will be fine. Do we need to buy this cotton farm or do we care? Cost 1300 to buy one. Okay, do we want to also... Get this one locomotive at a time. We can install the second filling station. Let's do that. So I really want to see this happen. I want to, did, did we actually make anything at the textile factory? I don't know if we can tell or not, but uh, nothing, nothing so far, unless there's some stuff over here. No clothing yet, no textiles yet. Now what happens when when we have too much leather, the train that delivers the leather there is simply gonna wait until it can unload stuff. I think I'm also gonna need another cotton train. So what I'm gonna do about this is, 
Um, let's build... Jeez. So much land to cross here. Okay, let's just go make a branch off point like this. Boop. Okay. Do I have to do... Oh, no. You have to actually go all the way here. Oh, that's annoying. That's very annoying. Okay. It'll be fine, though. It'll be fine. I, I was just, like, going to build a partial railroad. Uh, but it doesn't want to let me do that. So let's just do this. Confirm. Sure. 51,000. No, it's expensive. Ooh, Nashville mayor wants to develop a tourism business in his city. He's offered a grant to the first railroad company that can transport enough tourists. I read such an advertisement today in the Corporation Times, and you know what? This is a great opportunity for us to make more money and for you personally to gain experience in passenger transportation. Moreover, we're the only railroad company in this region. However, it's not necessary to do this. You're free to make your own decision. Okay. We're just going to confirm this. We have enough money for now. Let's get out of here and figure out what this contract thing is about. Okay, 50 tourists transported to Nashville. Now then, is that a special... Doesn't look like it's a special thing. So it looks like any anybody who is delivered here is going to count. Let's see. Do we have anybody going to Nashville? I don't think we have any people going to Nashville. I think everybody going there is just... Oh no, Chattanooga is taking them to Nashville. No, 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 no. Actually, haha. <laughs> nope. Um, Nashville, we are loading. Knoxville. Chattanooga, Knoxville. Nope. Nobody is actually going there passenger-wise. That's kind of sad. Let's see. Do we have enough here? We could take a passenger train from Knoxville to Nashville. That might be good. Let's just build one of those then. Let's build a train to do that. Add station, Knoxville, and Nashville. And we'll just load three passengers each. Okay, there we go. Apply, there we are. Okay, nice, and close. Okay, uh, right, we want to double track this area. This is kind of interesting let's just go off this side and we'll go ahead and go there and then add this kind of thing and then we'll add a passing point here oh no okay we have a little bit of wait I'm not sure what the heck happened there that was interesting or did it actually add something there uh, okay let me see if i can delete that whatever that was that tiny thing oh there it is okay let's see let's try and just do a standard kind of thing here okay confirm and then we'll build a bigger line to atlanta when we can afford it and i want to build a second uh train for the cotton there we go let us copy this the dewitt clinton there we go buy one yes take an overdraft we can afford it dear customer we bring to your attention that you have a line of credit with our bank maximum overdraft allowed is fifty thousand. please note if you exceed this limit your account's transactions will be stopped and your company will be frozen may i also remind you that the bank charges a daily fee for using a credit line account manager olive myers don't warn so we'll say closed she does look very strict about this but hopefully we'll be able to make enough money to not worry about this Okay, the clothes thing is ticking down. That's not great. I feel like maybe we should also put some passengers going from like Chattanooga to Nashville as well. Or we could build a second passenger line from Nashville to Knoxville. I don't know. These are looking good though. These little trains. The cotton. We need to make sure that we get those things delivered pronto. 
Okay, this is T6 has meat. Yay, meat. Yay. Okay, that's giving us a little bit of money, which is great. All right, and we're gonna have to start. Ooh, Fort Payne now demands grain and wood. So this is a kind of an interesting thing that basically any place that has an industry, like it used to be just a cotton farm and now it's like, hey, we decided we wanna be a city uh, so that they can, they can kind of do that. Now, what I think I'll do is we need to get this clothing now from Knoxville to Atlanta. So I'm gonna go ahead and make a train doing that. Uh, and we'll double track this a little bit later maybe, but this is gonna kinda be a loss, I believe, because once we deliver it, it's, um, yeah, not, not a happy thing. Okay, what do we got here with these trains here? Cargo is unloading, they have too much on the leather side of things. This is being refueled, 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 too many being refueled. These people are, oh no, do we have an issue? We have some kind of an issue here. Okay, this one is just too much stuff, too much on uh, the, the leather here. But these I don't understand. They should be already refueled. But that again, T10, Knoxville to Nashville. Um, next station, Knoxville, unless it's just unhappy that we have more trains on the line. Oh, oh no, it's because, no, no, there's, there's, there's a connection point here. I'm not quite sure why it's not going on the, uh, the line there. That's very strange. That's really not great, actually. Let's go ahead and upgrade this and get a, maybe another fueling station. Yep, this is not good. Okay, I don't understand this at all. So these are meant to go, this is Knoxville to Chattanooga. Those should go, there's no reason they shouldn't go. Maybe we can skip the station. Waiting for a free track. Okay. Train 10, Knoxville to Nashville. Let's go and skip. Okay, what's doing? Waiting for a free track. All right, that's fine. Okay, well, hopefully this kind of works itself out, I hope. In any case, let's start getting the uh, clothing delivered here. Man, this is gonna be not ideal, I think. Let's see, how's it going? Are we, how are we happy? We're not happy at all. Waiting for a free track. We are unpaused. Go to Knoxville. Apply. Waiting for a free track. Okay, now it's moving. Okay, so there are some like buggy things here. That's, there's no way that that should have happened. Okay, this is getting... Ah, yes, we're selling these good stuff here. Now then, I think what we might want to do is just buy the clothes factory before we send a train off because the clothes is going to cost us 20,000 each. So that's not ideal. Let's just buy the, oh, we can't for 89,000. Oh, I can't do that. Not now, not at the moment. Uh, I wish I could sell some of this clothes. Um, but we need how much? We need 10, right? But, uh, looks like maybe we can start getting the leather going as well. Uh, another thing we can do is do wood deliveries, but I'm kind of afraid to add more trains to this track because it's just so full. Now there is a lumber over here, but the lumber is used in specialty circumstances. Like there's a furniture place out here. Where is it? Furniture factory right there. They need um, textiles and wood for stuff. So I don't want to get involved in a huge production chain at the moment. Okay, there we go. We're getting some stuff coming in. Good, good. 
Come on, trains, let's go. Okay, stuff is being delivered. Things are going well. Yay, money, money. All right, so I want to get, let's buy this textile or this clothing factory. And then we're going to start transporting some of this clothes. Yeah, nope, not yet, not yet. Just a moment, we're going to buy one. And take stuff to Atlanta. Okay, broken while on the way. That's not ideal. Um, we might also... Uh, start replacing some of these locomotives that are really low percentage. 41, 19. Wow, that's horrible. Oh, that's because we don't have a repair shop. Oh, no. Okay, that's not ideal at all. Can we buy a repair shop here? Let's see. We can. All right. Yes. It's not that expensive. Okay, come on. Come on, trains. Make money. Go, go, go. I'm very much considering taking this clothes, some of it, and selling it in Nashville again. I think I think I actually should do that. Uh, we did buy this place. So let's make a little bit of money with this. Let's buy a locomotive. Yes. An ad station, Knoxville. To... Let's see. Nashville. Do they have excess of anything? They have a little bit of textiles, but I don't know if that's a thing. Okay, so we're going to load the clothing. Just going to take two and unload that in Nashville. 28,000 each. Uh, can we load anything else? Oh my gosh, they have posts there. Yay! But they probably want passengers. So let's take passengers and unload passengers. And then we'll go ahead and load some post here. Uh, oopsies. Wow. Okay. Too much. Too much. And unload the post. There we go. Apply. Good. Go. Let's unpause. There we go. Overdraft. Okay. Cargo is loading. Let's go train 12. You can do it. It'll be fine. I hope. Wow, there are so many trains at this station right now. There's train four, waiting for a free track. Okay, that's good. But we desperately need some of this money that this is gonna bring. Come on, come on out, waiting for a free track. Why is train 10 waiting here? What are you doing? Are you coming out or going in? Looks like it's going in. Nope. Come on, train 10. Train 10, what are you doing? Go, go, go. Maybe we need to just... Okay, there we go. Finally. Train 5. Train 12 is still waiting. No. Everything else has gone out. Except for that one. Why is this one waiting now? Okay, now that one's going. Good, good. 2 is going out. Come on, where's 12? Go. All right, let's see if we can improve this track a little bit. I don't know. I really wish you didn't have to do like these segment things. I guess we can uh, actually cancel. Maybe just go like this to add signals. I don't know. We'll wait till they're going. Come on. They are just waiting for- oh, this is broken. Oh, no. No. Chattanooga no longer demands grain. Oh, no. Huh, that's interesting. Does that mean the city is getting, like, smaller? That shouldn't be. We're delivering all kinds of stuff there. Come on, train, hurry up. Go, go, go. Okay, I'm hoping that this will create signals at either end here. But we'll see Knoxville no longer demands grain either. That's not good. Okay, come on trains. Go, go. Okay, so that one's good. 
Okay, let's see if that worked. It created... It did create two signals. Okay, so maybe that'll help us get stuff out of here. But we do need to look at our list of trains. Because there is a train going from Cookville to Knoxville. Okay, let's sell this train. We're going to scrap it. Yep. I wonder if that was the one stuck on the line that we waited for so long. No. Okay. 12 is finally going to make it out. Jeez. Wow. Let's see. We have 6 of 40 clothing. Okay. Yeah, that's kind of annoying. I have to say it's really, really annoying, in fact. I think with this one... What do we got here? We have nothing on this one. I'm going to... We're going to copy train 1. Buy. Yes. And take this one and scrap it. Okay, good. And then we're going to do the same with a lot of the other trains here. On the route. Because at the moment it's just pretty miserable. There's 12. Let's go with our precious clothing and some passengers. Okay. Money, please. Hello. Okay, we're going to copy this one and then delete this one. Scrap it. I don't really want to pay the maintenance on these things if the trains are going to be scrapped anyway. I, for, I mean, we do need to get the nicer locomotives. DeWitt Clinton. Oh, so cute. I think this is one I have in my model railroads. They're so cute. Come on, train 12. Go, go, go. This one. Wow. Locomotive condition zero. Whoa. Let's copy this one and scrap it. That's six. Delete. Because that's a way to get stuff off the line. Okay, this one needs to have service. Apply. Okay, this one is also Dewitt Clinton. Yeah, that's the one we like. Let's go ahead and get this one serviced as well. Is this one already so low? Gee, okay. Let's go a little bit slower again. But these two definitely need to be organized. So we're going to need a train to go to Atlanta. We might as well start getting this stuff transferred because we don't actually have... Well, we're, we're... Yeah, we're getting low on days. Let's just go ahead and buy it. Uh, even though... Yeah, it's fine. Knoxville. Uh, load... One, two, three, four. No, three is fine. And then go to Atlanta. I'm really watching like a hawk my budget here. Okay. But the thing is, it's not going to give us any money. So it's a huge, huge, bad, bad thing. I think we're going to go postal here. Take maybe one passenger. Uh, no, not that many because it's going to be very expensive. So we're going to unload the post. There we go. Apply. Go. And I don't think there's any way that you can designate these as an express train, for example. Oh, but it's already going. That's good. That's so weird that it was just like instant. Oof, we have 50,000. That must have been train 12 arriving here. Yes, it is. Very nice. Okay. So we do have a repair shop here, I believe, now, right? Yes, we do. Okay, that's great. And then at Chattanooga, we have all the good things here. Two locomotives, good. We can refill uh, some at the same time, which is great. Now, what do we have in excess of? We do have tons of cotton there. Uh, here we could use cotton, but we're lacking in trains to transport this cotton. Um, let's just add another one of these trains. So we're going to copy this. Go ahead. Buy it. Good. Is this one waiting? 
moving, waiting probably for that one. That's such a weird thing, I have to say, this whole, like you have to do. Confirm, okay, that gives us a signal there. And I guess we can have another one here. Confirm. Right, maybe we'll do some the other way as well. Don't know. Come on. Behave yourself thing. Confirm. In here. Yeah, I just... It's interesting the way the signals are going here. It's just kind of crazy. Kind of weird. Doesn't make a lot of sense. I hope that they add some stuff to make it closer to um, Railway Empire or any other sort of track system that really works well. Let's just go ahead and double track this area as well. I'm gonna make segments instead of stuff. It looks like, yeah, you have to just manually put in the signals by doing segments. I can see it actually putting in a signal every time I click the button there. It's kinda not ideal. Really not ideal. There we go. 39,000. Wow. Yep, and it does the segments there. I wish there was a way to add signals that was a little bit easier. Um, yeah, but hopefully it's going to be fine. Hopefully it'll be good. So we have things going. We have post offices. We have probably we would need to make might be nice to have some kind of deliveries from Chattanooga, like maybe postal or passengers or meat. We could do meat. Meat. Uh, let's do the meat. Oops, nope, we don't need these people. Let's get a going from Chattanooga to Atlanta. And we'll load, we'll just have a fast train, maybe just passengers. Three. Yeah, let's do three. Unload three. Unload passengers. Sure. Unload passengers. Apply. Okay. And then we're going to pause and copy this station, copy the thing. We're going to do something different. Let's clear. Remove all actions. We're gonna load at Chattanooga mail. I think we can only do two for now. And unload mail. There we go. Apply. And then we're gonna copy it again. And this time we'll do meat. Meat from uh, Fort Payne. No, not Fort Payne, Chattanooga. Load meat. We can only do two, looks like it. Can we do an extra passenger there? Sure, it'll be fine. Unload, meet, meet. Passengers, good. And then in Atlanta, I guess we can do like three passengers again. Uh, that'll be okay. Apply. Okay, so we have now stuff. We've got several trains on this line now, and it makes me think that we probably need to add some signals here too. Uh, confirm. Looks like maybe just double clicking on the spot. There we go. Uh, well, at least we figured it out. Cancel. Confirm. Signal's good. Railroad is occupied by train. Oh, it is there. Okay. That's fine. Okay. Ooh, great news. A recent purchase of a textile ferry factory will bear its fruit today. The furniture factory, Birmingham, wishes to sign a contract for textile delivery. Production and delivery of this commodity can slow down our progress on the Atlanta closed contract, but it brings more money for the company and new experience for you. However, I will use the money somewhere else. Ten carriages. Oh, man. Mmm... No, I, no, nope, nope, nope. All right, train, hurry up, go. Because as it is, I think we don't have enough days for the other thing. Come on, thing, hurry up, go. Please, go. I want to confirm. Let me confirm. 
Railroad is not occupied by train. I promise you it isn't. Once that train is in the shed there, I will, or at the station, I will pause and add more of these things. Confirm. There we go. Oh boy, this is, um, yeah. This is such a weird thing. We have very, very, very little money. Okay, go. Okay, and if worse comes to worse, we can always sell a train. That's, that's kind of what you do if you're like really in dire straits there. You just sell one of your trains. Okay, overdraft has been used for $140. This cotton farm, upkeep of $500 a month to get $1,300 cotton. I don't know how long it takes. That's the thing is I don't know how long it takes to go from place to place um, and figure out how much cotton we can actually deliver. Oh, darn it. I should have signed the textile thing because it was textiles, not clothing. No. Oh, well. Okay. In any case, let's check on our train list here. We have this one, which definitely needs to be upgraded. Uh, the same here. As soon as we get some money. Come on, money. But what about train? Let's see. Is it train 12? That was the clothing train? Oh yes, this is our money train coming in. 28,000 per clothing thing. Um, but then of course the big one is, let's see, it's gonna go Knoxville. Where is that one that we had? The clothing one. This one, I think. Okay, so this one is over here right now. Okay, we can change this one here. Let's copy this one. That's train four. Okay, and then scrap this one. Yes, good. It's kind of weird. I wish there was a thing like grab new engine or something at the next station instead of delete replace 11% that's horrible but it's kind of sitting at the station so it's not that big of a deal I could actually just get rid of this uh, thing wow it's worth a lot of money though this uh, the cargo on this train boop boop Okay, Chattanooga now demands lumber. Ooh. Well then, that's quite tasty. Ah, because it's part of the city now. Okay. So we could actually make this nice little thing here and get that going. That could be fun. But, oh my goodness, I have just looked at the time. I've been so addicted to playing this. The episode has gone on for almost an hour. Oh my goodness. We're going to stop here then. Thank you so very much for joining me. Take care of yourselves and each other. And I'll see you next time.